Hi guys, how are you all doing? And welcome back to the Isle of Wight Youth for Christ channel. And today, guys, uh, we're playing FIFA again. We're not actually playing FIFA with, um, while recording this because um, I messed up the recording. Um, so we're just um, overlaying this footage on top of the thing. Um, so yeah, we've got Andy's testimony um, to come. So if you want to hear a bit more about Andy, stay tuned as that's coming up. I'm very much looking forward to watching this game back. I might say the score though. <laughs> Video clip. And here, for you here we go. Juventus so, kick off. Arsenal. Please don't destroy me too much. That's already happened. Not that I'm giving away any of the scores. But we have already played this game. Oh, yeah, I remember. You can't have it. Have it. I win. Blaise <laughs> well, my high my Arsenal guys, by the way. <laughs> yeah, good one. Mario Mazzucic is the main striker today. So Andy, how did you become a Christian? So, I became a Christian when I was 17, which is five years ago. You saying I'm cold or what you Yeah, so I was... Um, my, my dad took me to church when I was, when I was little, um, with my brother. Um, but I stopped going when I was around, when I was around 10. Um, I just thought it was pretty dead and, like, it's just... Just not very interesting. I mean, just... Not gonna lie, it was extremely dull and boring. Anything to do with God, anything to do with church. So I just went away from it, and then um, the I started, started to become friends with um, yeah, a good friend of mine, um, who's yeah, well, just really, really good like Christian that. guy. Um, and and he brought me along to Alpha Course. Um, he brought him and his sister and brought a good couple goal. of us along, along to an Alpha Course, which was really good. Um, and I just Oh, actually, for those of you who don't know about Alpha, I just realised I've scored, and I think I'm about to score again, so we'll just, yeah. just pause for that one. What a hit, son. What a hit. Um, back to where we were. Oh, God. Alpha, yeah. um, for those of you who don't know what Alpha is, it's like this course that you go through um, with, yeah, it's just all about, it's like about life, it's about Christianity, loads of different questions and different topics, yeah, yeah. based around Christian things. Yeah. Um, so I got through the course and really, really enjoyed it. So I'd go into church with my mate um, and yeah, and his Ramsey. sister, which was really, Good really cool. Here. And then, um, um, yeah. yeah, just, oh, how did you save that? Huh? Save. What a joke. Um, Getting distracted. <laughs> yeah, and, um, and so I just, I, was I remember I was praying one night because I, I heard those baptisms coming up. I was thinking, am I Christian? Do Sandra. I know, like... You know, how do I know? How do I know what's going on? And I, I was praying to God, and he just, yeah, just felt like an overwhelming sense of his presence, and they were had to, like, kind of commit to, to him. But that's not to say that that happens to everyone. Like, yeah, right now. Um, yeah you, it, it might not be a case of an overwhelming experience for each of you, but that's that's just what mine was. Yeah. Yeah, and then, um, yeah, that was about five years ago. That's really cool. And then I got baptized. Really yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. That's his um, game, watching isn't it? This, uh, good memories with it. Well, it's probably a bit of torture for you, isn't it? It was, you know. I'm just doing this for the views, isn't it? <laughs> for the views, what, what, the, tw what the 12 <laughs> views that we're going to get on this channel? Uh, we get like 40 views per video. Oh, sorry. I, yeah, I, you better be. I underestimated you, mate. You, you underestimated me. <laughs> well, if it's me, if I'm put me in the title and you might get up to 50, I'm hoping, yeah. Chance to get some width into this attack. <laughs> that's that's to triggered. To the <laughs> that's triggered. Well, what's your next question? Dybala. <laughs> what's your favourite bit of the Bible? What's your favourite bit of the Bible? Um, Obviously, I love the Gospels. Um, is it not all of it? Gospels, the full, full as in, as in like oh, is the whole is, Bible. The whole Bible, yeah. The whole Bible is God's word, so the whole Bible is amazing. So yeah, good. don't, yeah. So thanks for reminding me there, Reese. It's alright, no, got your back. But I've got a favourite, and uh, yeah, I love the Gospels. Of course, that shows how much Jesus loves us. But I think looking at the letters, there's so much um, practical, uh, like wisdom and knowledge in there. Like, um, <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of a uh, lot of practical knowledge of what it means to follow Jesus and like have Jesus as Lord as well. So uh, yeah, I definitely think I think Romans is an amazing letter as well. It's awesome, and, like First Corinthians and Philippians and James. Just yeah, just a few of them. You can just read them and like. You don't have to have like read anything before, and you can just open it up, and you know you're going to get some good wisdom there. So um, 
so I definitely think it's been Letizia. Letizia are really, yeah, really great to read. Yeah, well, should, should, that. should have been five, but my keeper's just insane. It's it should be six, but my keeper's pulled up two and insane true. saves. Well, so it's half time, and it is. You're you falling up. Oh, no, it's it's that got? There might not be too much of a contest left in this game. Did you, did, did you keep a clean, clean sheet though? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Shortly to be revealed. <laughs> yeah. Just pull the tension up. Yeah, exactly. Oh. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> Nobody knows these days. Oh, is that five? Is that five? It wasn't because it should have gone to lack of it. They stopped him in the Sandy, what brought you to the Isle of Wight? So. Um, Excellent interception. Got it shot off now. Time was, was it three years ago? It must have Looking been three years ago. Um, I came back from South and Africa and I was kind of wondering what to do Charles with really pretty much with my life. You know, like Anything everyone, but. all my mates were going off to uni. They knew exactly what they were doing. And, yeah. um, so I'd been really encouraged by a few people who were like, I think you should kind of go into some kind of full time. Christian work. Shots so. on here. Yeah. He's and I thought, okay, well. that's really cool. And I was really, really kind of felt like going into youth ministry or um, like youth Benalli work Benucci. was something that I was passionate about. I really Miriam keen for young people to know Sammy who Jesus Kadir. is. And Jesus loves, loves you guys. Um, and so I applied to a university called Moreland, which um, where I was doing a degree in theology, Benalli. which I'm doing yeah, at the moment um, and so I got some really good advice from my old youth pastor there um, at my old youth pastor who actually went to Moreland a number of years ago he said he, he just thought my skill sets would be uh, would be best to do a placement alongside it to do some practical work Yes, I've scored! Enjoy it whilst it This is the thing like straight after you, uh, oh no we can't say we won't say how many goals and what happens yet. next. Uh, oh, well, what, what's going to happen next? I, wonder, to go I, don't know. Into I can't actually remember. You scored just Not about here. You scored as well. I did score. I can't believe I did that to a friend. We're halfway through through my question, my answer. So my my old youth pastor, yeah, he said that my skill set would be good to do a placement alongside it, um, like doing some practical work um, alongside doing a degree. Um, partly because he said that he didn't think that academic work was probably my uh, my forte, which is uh, which, <laughs> I don't think that's a true statement. To be fair. Um, yeah, and, and then so I looked around and there Good was Youth for Christ. I like Youth for Christ advertised like a free year placement on their website. I came over here for like three days, did an interview, and really enjoyed what what I saw here and like kind of what Youth for Christ here stood for. Yeah. And um, Poor at a blast, yeah, and I just really. decided that I felt like this is what God wanted me to do. Yeah, pretty cool. Oh mate, oh, oh, he's well, done his way dirty. He's threatened me there. That was a bit of revenge, but that was the nicest sweat. And the dab to finish it off. That is disgusting. Well, we know the life of a keeper, you make a mistake and invariably... Why didn't you want to look? Because I just thought it broke up. That was a big mistake. Only two of them, but you know... Yeah, there's only two. I still. At least the goal difference was only three, not five. Yeah, that's true. At least Jesus still loves you. At least Jesus still loves you. Well, Andy, that was a great game of FIFA. Good game, mate. Good to rewatch it. Great to rewatch it. Thanks very much for coming and sharing a bit more of your testimony. Um, no worries, mate. Um, yeah, so guys, thanks very much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please go and drop a like on the video. Um, if you haven't seen our content on your screens before and you enjoyed it, please go and subscribe and click the little bell to get notifications on when we're going to be uploading. Yeah, so guys, all it leaves us to say is thank you and goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs>